second semi-final in the women's 100 metres for the T37 category. And this can include the gold world record holder and gold medalist from the World Championships in Lyon 12 months ago, Mandy Francois Elly. And we have six competitors in lane two. Heather Jameson of Ireland has a personal best of 15.08 run 15.25 this season and the gold medal favorite Mandy Francois Ellie the world and European record holder has a personal best of 13.2 Jenny McLaughlin of Great Britain will be the home favorite and 14.43 this season Isabel Ford of Germany Possible challenges to Mandy Francois Ali, Svetlana Sergeva of Russia, and Marta Langner of Poland will be on the outside in lane seven. But all eyes here will be on lane three. What can Mandy Francois Ali do in her opening race? at these European Championships. She'll be running in the 100 metres and the 400 metres here in Swansea after completing the sprint double in the World Championships in Lyon 12 months ago. And they get away first time, and Francois Eli makes a good start, but she's been pressurized by Jenny McLaughlin inside. But here comes the world record holder and the world champion. It's going to be a victory for Mandy Francois Eli and McLaughlin in second. It's a race for third, which may have been taken on the line by Svetlana Sergeva. And the time, very, very impressive from Mandy Francois Eli. 14.08 and that's just an early warm-up for the world record holder and Mandy Francois Eli knew she had that get that in control for a long long time ran it down to 14.06 again eventually and it was Marta Langner of Poland who took third place and Svetlana Sergeva will have to see if she could be one of the fastest losers but Francois Eli won that race very, very comfortably. Jelly McLaughlin did well to stay in her slipstream, and her time of 14.38 is a personal best, with Marta Langner in third, 14.84. Those three go through as of right, and the next two fastest losers qualify for the final. So both Sergeva of Russia and Heather Jameson of Ireland will be looking to see if their times compare to the opening semi-final. And they do, and they both qualify. Svetlana Sergeva and Heather Jameson go through as the fastest losers. But... It's all about Mandy Francois Eli in the T37 100 metres. A very comfortable victory. And the two fastest losers come from the second semi final. So here is the full list of qualifiers for the final. Svetlana Sergeva and Heather Jameson go through as the fastest losers. But it's all about Mandy Francois Eli in the T37 100 metres. A very comfortable victory. And the two fastest losers come from the second semi final. 
So here is the full list of qualifiers for the final.